Security deposit. <laughs> well, thanks, but I'm looking for more general information about the area. Is this a good community? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you should talk to some of the locals. Why don't you go over there? We've had a long journey here to Cooper Bino. Your Highness, are you hungry? Did you bring any food? We brought go. Like what? Well, let me tell you. <laughs> 
Now I'd be the chair of rural community service. When some loud mouth Kowanian tries to put me down. And We'll make a difference now, we'll miss a lease of bang the gavel now. By Michiganders. For example, the fifth Rotarian, Harry Ruggles, was a printer from Michigan. And it is said that he brought a bunch of UMich grads from Ann Arbor to Chicago on the backs of Wolverines to join the university. Uh, Our leader valiant. Lisa, as you can see, your high function as you said it would. And I have to say that many of us enjoyed learning about these amazing bees. <laughs> now with your reign coming to an end, you're about to take on the best role in a club. Now do you know what that is? Uh, <laughs> aren't those rotary colors? Yeah. Also, <laughs> Very good. Hi, good evening. 
So as the mayor of Cooper, we know. <laughs> I have the honor of presenting a proclamation which is befitting the Queen Bee. Um, the pro proclamation is from the city of Cooper, we know. <laughs> and uh, recognizes uh, Alyssa for all her many uh, achievements. Uh, she came just at the right time. She helped me personally. She helped me professionally. And it was just an absolute joy to, to work with her. So whoever is coming next, uh, if you want a proclamation, <laughs> I know Jeff and Alyssa tell us all the things they want to do. And uh, I can't imagine a, a luckier uh, city. And um, all thanks to... Remember you saying did you? Uh, last year? Uh, <laughs> yeah. Well, you guys, um, you know, I've always used the beehive as my, my theme for the year because I truly think that our club is like a beehive where everyone works together. We have great communications, teamwork. We're all working toward a common goal. We all have different jobs to do and all of the jobs are needed. Um, you guys call me the queen bee, but the queen bee isn't really any more important than any other bee in this hive. It takes all of us to do this, so I thank you so much, but thank you for making me feel like a queen today. <laughs> thank you so much. And, um, do you want one more bee fun fact? Yeah. One last bee fun fact? So, um... The bees in the hive, some, the summer bees only live a couple of weeks, the winter bees maybe a couple of months. The queen bee can live for about three to five years, but she can't live forever. And the hive makes a decision when it's time for her to not be the queen anymore. And they raise a new queen, they select a new queen, and then to depose the queen, one of the ways they get rid of her is they all gather around her get closer and closer and closer and suffocate her <laughs> and so when I tell this to kids when I'm teaching a class to very young kids I say they get really close to her and they hug her so tight that she 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 dies and I, I just think <coughs> new coming president Jeff President like Jeff, you realize the enormity of the role that you're taking up. Thank you. Now, now. Hey, Thank you. Hey, Thank you for your time today. You're welcome again. Okay, so one, a few final words, and wow, what tough shoes to fill. But I have something that I picked up from Singapore. You know, many of us went to Singapore, and it's a, it's a pair of socks. But the saying on the socks was so appropriate. It is B. Keep on. So be, keep on. Ha <laughs> ha. Thank you. 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 Thank you.